what is signal to noise ratio and how does that impact acoustic accessibility? Signal to noise ratio is the relationship between the desired signal, typically the speech of the teacher, but it could be the speech of children, and background noise, which is anything that interferes with that desired signal. The more intelligible the speech, the better the signal to noise ratio, the more acoustic access that child will have to auditory information in the classroom. Adults with typical hearing and who've had decades of life and language experience and neural development need the desired signal to noise ratio to be about plus 6 dB. And that means in taking some acoustic license that the desired signal needs to be about twice as loud as background sounds. Now children need the signal to be 10 times louder, plus 15 to plus 20 dB in order to receive intelligible speech. Children need a more redundant extrinsic or external signal. Now, here's the problem. Adults are the ones who design classrooms, who set up classrooms, who design learning spaces. So an adult might walk into a learning space and think, wow, this sounds just fine to an adult with a fully developed auditory neural system, with decades of life and language experience and exposure, and to an adult who doesn't require the same signal to noise ratio advantage that a child requires. So you see, that's the problem. A classroom that feels and sounds good to an adult may not have appropriate acoustic accessibility for a child.